What's going on, you guys? Welcome back to the channel. So today, to continue the series, we are going to be wrapping this M4. Um, one of the first and proper things to do is to go ahead and wash and clay bar the car so we can decontaminate it. So let's get on with it. All right guys, so now that the car is fully prepped, ready for wrap, we are going to go through the disassembling stage, which requires to remove mirrors, door handles, existing trims, tail lights. That way we could just make the wrap look so much more proper. So let's go ahead and get right to it and start disassembling. All right guys, so we pretty much have the trunk prepped up. We removed the tail lights, emblems, OEM spoiler. So now we have to tackle down the rear bumper. So that means removing the bumper, the side reflectors and all the trims. So let's get on with that and let's get this car prepped up for the wrap. All right guys, so now we made it to the door portion. So for this, we need to disassemble the side mirror, door trim, handle. In order to do that, we have to remove this door card and obviously get into here to get into the door handle. So let's get on to doing that, guys.
What's going on guys? So as you can see, the M4 is fully disassembled. It looks a lot different than it did in the first video. Our technician went ahead and removed the front bumper, rear bumper. We even took off the door handles, tail lights, and all this stuff just to ensure the wrap gets in all these crevices and tight corners as best as possible. Preparation is key with any wrap because we want to ensure the longevity of the film stays on as best as it can. But right now we're going to pass the mic over to our wrapper so we can kind of explain in detail what areas we plan to tackle first and then we'll go from there. What's up guys, my name is Matt. I go by Z Wraps Customs on Instagram. And as we mentioned, the first thing I'm gonna tackle is the rear quarter panel, just because it's one of, if not the biggest part on the car to wrap. And it'll give us a really good idea of what the color is actually gonna look like. And I'm super excited, so let's get started. All right guys, so that's gonna end it for today's video. As you can see, the color the client decided to go with is a Nozatex Norwal Blue. I think it's a really nice blue. It's gonna complement everything that we have planned for this build. We already tackled both recorder panels. We've gotten both doors done. We've gotten the hood done and both fenders. So we've made tons of progress already. But in the next video guys, we're gonna be showing you the kit that we're gonna be putting on this car. It's gonna look really good. You don't wanna miss it. So stay tuned guys, we'll catch you on the next one.